the color was doing what it's supposed to do. <laughs> Hi you guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. This is Life with Darielle and I'm Darielle for anybody that's new. Welcome to all my newcomers and hello to anybody that's been watching me thus far. If you're interested in exploring life with me, make sure you subscribe to this channel. And if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like, comment, and share. Anyways you guys, let's get straight into the video. Alrighty, anyways you guys, you guys can tell by that title, as you can tell by that thumbnail, we're going to be discussing what's in my work bag. So you guys, I purchased this bag about a few years ago, I want to say probably 2021. This was my second coach bag purchase that I personally purchased myself but it's just big enough to carry all of my things that I need for work however I do actually want to kind of get like a bag organizer because it's a lot of stuff going on so let's get straight into it because I don't like the long intros Alrighty, you guys so the first thing that I want to discuss with you that's in my bag or tends to be in my bag a lot is my iPad my boyfriend got me this iPad on my birthday I used to have an iPad mini but it just wasn't allowing me to update anymore and I'm pretty sure because it was pretty old but the color isn't lavender purple just in case you guys can't see it and he also got me the Apple pen I love this pen to death you guys it is dead <laughs> which is like crazy because I need to edit but you know it just it does what it needs to do and then I can just place it like this and then I can edit that way so that is the first thing my iPad the next thing that I want to discuss with you guys is this lovely bag that I got from uh Walmart I tend to have you know baby wipes panty liners air freshener hand lotions etc etc and I realized they were getting lost in my bag because like you guys will see this is a pretty big bag and obviously it's enough space for something to get lost in so what I tend to and I apologize if you can hear like any pill shaking but what I tend to have is these are my baby wipes I'll pull it out for you guys okay so it has my baby wipes these are the hello bello brand i love 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 these actual wipes my um the person that does my wax i love her to death she put me onto these actually the next thing that tends to be in this little zippy is my air freshener from bath and body works i hope you guys can see that there we go this is the mahogany coconut i just spray one or two because it can be very potent in the bathroom and let me tell y'all people are like, oh it smells good what did you spray girl mahogany coconut <laughs> Anyways, the next thing which I need to re-up on tomorrow is my Touchland um, spray mist for hand sanitizer. I love this. If you wear glasses as well, fun fact, this actually cleans your glasses very good, better than any dang on your glasses cleaner that I've used. The next thing that I have is I tend to have two hand moisturizers in here, and they actually both are in here. Okay, so the first set is the Stress Relief, and this is the Eucalyptus Experiment from Bath & Body Works. Um, and then the next thing I have is again with the hand sanitizer you guys I found these at Target some time ago and I just you know just keep them in there just in case and it's the Puro you just well it's, it's like the Puro singles and you just pop these open pop it on your hand and then it's basically a hand sanitizer and there is a generous amount in here if I might say the next thing being is Vaseline. Just in case I run out of lip balm or hand lotion, Vaseline, she that girl, she ain't gonna fail you. Alrighty, and as I stated, panty liners. If you're a woman, you know, you know why we need those, okay? And because I wear glasses and I look at a computer screen five days a week, sometimes I can get a headache, which could just be very annoying. So I normally have the Excedrin, the extra strength. This is a big bottle. My boyfriend got this for me, I think either on Valentine's Day or one of our anniversaries. And y'all, when I tell y'all these little pills be coming in clutch, and I definitely try to keep them in my purse as well because of him, because he tends to get headaches as well. And I'm like, okay, I need to make sure he has these just in case. And then the other set is the Shea Butter um, by Bath & Body Works as well. And this is their hand cream. I hope you guys can see that. And yeah. Alrighty, so the next thing I like to make sure I always have in my purse is the Johnson & Johnson little travel um, kit for whenever, you know, first, it's like a little travel first aid kit. And it has like wipes, band-aids, but I also, because I need to buy something else, put these little, basically like little paper towels, like you wet it, it turns into paper towel, um, just in case the bathroom doesn't have any. And if I wring it out well enough, it dries my hands just as well if it was a dry paper towel. And then I also try to make sure I always keep like a little whisk in there that also has like the little floss part on there just for like if you're going out to eat and you know like if you eat garlic or if you taste it, your mouth you're like something don't taste right those definitely come in clutch the next thing that i like to have in my bag is the gum 
Mentos gum. These are these little cute little travel things. My boyfriend found these some months ago at CVS by his job. Ever since then, I love them and I try to keep the container, just buy a bigger one and refill it. It's just very, you know, comfortable, especially when I have like my smaller purses. It definitely comes in clutch. The next thing that I always make sure I have is obviously the wallet. Where you going without a wallet? You need your wallet so it can have your IDs, your debit cards, your money. You know, you got to get around. You got to get around. However, let me tell y'all something a lot of people don't notice. But in my wallet, I have this little heart shape. It's supposed to be a heart. He tried, y'all. It's this little heart shape that my boyfriend gave me like several months ago. And I just keep it in my wallet. And every time I see it, like if I got to go get change, it just makes me smile. And all the little coins that he's given me throughout our relationship. Yes, y'all. He done gave me some coins. You don't believe me? Let me show you. Hold on, y'all. Let me, let me get one for you. Let me get one. Let me get one. Okay, so I think this is the... Is this a dollar? It's a half a dollar. He gave me this. It's like every time he finds like these little unique coins that you don't see as often, he always used to give me them. Or he still does here and there if he can find them. So yes, you guys, that's my wallet. It has this. It's in here. The next thing is always, always, always thank you, Grandma, for this. And she taught me about keeping a notebook and pen. Just in case if you ever got to write something down, you always just have it. Also, inside my little notebook. My little, we took these a long time ago, actually, last year. You can kind of say I'm probably obsessed with my relationship, and it is a problem. <laughs> but the next thing is Pepto, because your girl is lactose, and if you lactose, then you know we be acting like we can just eat and drink anything, and it look good, it tastes good, but your stomach be wanting to cuss you out, like, girl, what is you doing? So we always got to keep some Pepto on the deck, you know what I'm saying? But the next thing, I don't know if I can show this to y'all, so I'm going to hide it, but you know, stranger danger, you know, if a little weird person around you, just real quick. So I definitely, must definitely have that in my purse and always for my iPhone users, because if you know, you know, these freaking phones die so quick. So to tie into my actual charger is I always make sure my phone <laughs> is in my bag. Like it, it just, it's a necessity if I need to call somebody or text somebody, which is mainly my boyfriend, because your girl really don't be talking to people, which is fine, which is fine. But those two always have to be in my bag at all times. So let's get into the next thing. Alrighty, so the next thing I wanna get into, I'm not saying I, God forbid, get sick that often, but, you know, if you ever get, like, a little, <coughs> or somebody around you is coughing a little bit too much, these little Vicks Vapor Cools, y'all, when I tell y'all these things will have your throat just soothing the heck out of your throat, get these, y'all. I think I got these from either Walmart or Target. These be coming in clutch, and like I said, it's for either yourself or if somebody near you is coughing. It's just always nice to have these inside of your actual bag. But I don't have a lot of things left, so we're going to get straight into these next two items. That is most definitely a necessity for me, is my lip gloss. Now, my sister put me on to this next one. It is the Butter Gloss. It is in the color uh, Fortune Cookie Biscuits, and it is BLGD13. That's the color, y'all. And she put me on to this one by LA Colors, the clear gloss, years ago. And if you know, you know this is my jam. But I got into this one after I went to my boyfriend's sister's wedding because it's the lip gloss that my sister, you know, put on my lips after she lined it up. And I was like, ooh, yeah, girl, this is cute because I... Let's side note, because I am of a darker tone, I've always been kind of skeptical of using any like light colored lip gloss, especially when I used to use red and somebody had made fun of me for wearing like red lip red lipstick. And ever since then, I've just been kind of like skeptical of ever doing anything light. But she put this on and if you've seen it, it is in a short, so make sure you go check that out. Um, but it definitely, it was giving. The color was doing what it's supposed to do. <laughs> but anyways, you guys, so because I don't want to keep you guys here too long. This is just my work bag. I could do a more in-depth video of like what I put in like my bag, period. Of like really going through everything, having some links for you guys. But this is just what I use for like during the week. But the next thing being is I always have to have a spray. If you don't see my videos a few times, then you know. I always have to have a perfume spray. Now, I have three. <laughs> I won't get into all three because y'all probably be like, girl, actually, bump that. We gonna get into all three because we a family over here. So like I told you guys, I be having three little travel size perfumes in my bag at all time. The next one being a Dolce & Cabana light blue. Okay. And the third one being, this is by Coach. I don't remember exactly what scent this is. 
I don't remember, but this is also by Coach as well. So I just like to, you know, have some smell goods just in case if, you know, I want to switch it up or, you know, if you just feel like, oh, I want to smell a little bit pretty or you didn't put none on at home, these are definitely clutch to have in your bag so you don't actually have to travel around with bigger ones. But anyways, let's get into these last few items, you guys. I hope you guys have been enjoying this video. If you haven't done so already, have you liked the video? Have you commented? Like, come on, y'all. I'm trying to grow this family. Share the video so that we can engage and grow more and more and be able to explore this thing called life. But anyways, let's get into these last few items. Alrighty, so I checked and I only have three more items left. So the next one being is the Clorox Mist Spray. This is in the scent um, Lemongrass Mandarin. Um, let me tell you guys something. A lot of people be dirty. They just, I don't know, I... OCD, when people use a toilet that I have to use, I just sit there. All you do is push this down. I'm not going to spray it in my car, obviously, because I'm sitting in a car and it, it can be kind of strong. And I just pull it, push it down, and then spray, and then wipe. You can also use um, Clorox wipes. Sometimes I'll use that, but I've learned that this is just pretty convenient just to have this, throw it in my purse, and then spray. And it does last a long time. I did get this in Target. If you are interested, I'm pretty sure you can get it in Amazon as well. The next thing, you guys, the last two... This is the last one of the two, is Carmex Lip Balm. Y'all, I don't know how people be doing this, but some people be walking around with some chap lips, and I be like, girl, or boy, I'm like, you don't, you don't feel that? They don't feel uncomfortable every time you... They don't feel uncomfortable to you because it look kind of uncomfortable. Like, y'all, these things, you can literally get this at Dollar Tree for a dollar... It ain't even Dollar Tree no more, y'all. Let's be realistic. What is that? A dollar twenty-five. Anyways, but you could get that. It doesn't have to be Carmex, but some type of lip balm to keep your lips moisturized, especially as a man, because not everybody wears lip gloss. You know, just to keep your lips moisturized, especially if you have, are in a relationship and you want to be kissing on your boyfriend or your girlfriend. Don't know. I'm be honest with you. Don't know anybody trying to kiss on nobody with a rough behind lips. Ain't nobody trying to get no cuts or nothing like that because you don't want to moisturize your lips. So Carmex, get you some or lip balm. Period. Anyways, you guys, let's get into the last item now i got this from where i got you from child tj maxx <laughs> these are travel size uh travel straws period it comes with two different types i only have two in here right now the other two are in my office but the first one it looks like this and then the second one will just basically bend but both of them are in my office and then it comes with the straw cleaner y'all if you eat out at restaurants or you forget a straw for your coffee because you really shouldn't be just drinking coffee out of the cup or you know if you want to be bougie and put it in your water or your soda whatever these are definitely a must these were only four dollars and 99 cents and it came with the actual travel bag the straws and the cleaners but anyways you guys that is all that i have to show you guys for what's in my everyday bag i hope you guys enjoyed this video and until next time don't forget to subscribe like comment and share until next time you guys peace